take out the trash? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> is this how we're gonna start? Are we checking your teeth? Hello, you guys, and welcome to Natalie and Dennis. Show. Oh, I almost knocked down the cactus. The okay, let's show. Do it. Hello there, and welcome to the Natalie and Dennis show. Do no, that was bad. Redo. Oh Hello there, and welcome to the Natalie and, and Dennis show. Show, okay. show them the sushi, Jupiter. Right, after a good, what, what is it, almost two years? Yeah. We're finally doing a house tour. Yay! Oh, haven't we done one before? We've done an empty house tour. We've never done a built house tour. Oh, I got you. Uh, as many of you guys know, Dennis and I were moving in literally four like days. Four days. It's crazy. So we we're like, you know what? We're gonna miss this house. We're still gonna be here back and forth, but we're mostly gonna be in LA. Nally, stay focused. Oh, look at our picture there. It took me a while to convince her to let me put that up there because yes. we were like, that's too cheesy. I hate I'm pictures like, our of house. ourselves. Welcome to the front of our house. As you will see right over here, we have this little key thing. Dennis barely ever puts the keys I here. do. No. I do put I the put keys here. This is Jupiter's um, outlets, little incorporated thing. Jupiter, show them all your toys. Go be happy. And right over here, we have this cute little mirror and little plant and all these decorations. Wait, what is that? What the heck is that? I think it fell. All right, anyways, should we go left or right? Let's go right, okay. The house is dirty, nothing is perfect. We try our best, whatever. This is Jupiter's bed. He likes to be here every night and relax. Oh yeah, there's my little baby. There's poop in there. No, there's not. We said that in the last time. This is our bathroom. It's super cute. I decorated it. I did these little cactuses here, and I'm so proud of this bathroom. I put these little gold things on this uh, picture, and then I signed it so it looked more professional. This is here and there. Just in case people want to put on some perfume. All right, so now we move into this section. Now this right over here. Oh, are we doing the good or the ugly? Part? Yuck. This is one of our biggest regrets, not getting the stairs done. Okay, seriously, Bubba? <laughs> yeah, one of our biggest regrets, hopefully we can get it done. We never got around to it, so that's what's going on. Usually when you're gonna buy a house, they offer like a lot of upgrades. If you can, get with it. the company early. Yeah, it's the best thing. Right over here, we have our first living room. Quite casual. I kept it with grays and pinks. Everybody always asks me how did Dennis allow me to bring pink into this house? I mean, no, I, I like bothered. it. This is actually one of my first purchases ever. Everybody told me that I would regret it, and I don't. This was my first piece in my house, and I, I love it so much. Dennis supposedly cleaned this. I don't know, it's kind of streaky. Windex. All around the house, you guys will see little statues like this, and if you see them, comment the timestamp. These are cause statues. Dennis is in love with these, so we have a bunch of these all around. There's another one right over there. Keep it simple. This book is really great. I really recommend it. This is our second living room, I guess. Yay! So the front, and then we have the back living room. Over there is our prized possession, our million plaque. There's not really much to what say. Jupiter's a little bowl. We never really got around to decorating this either. Like, I wish we had put something here. It's a little bland, but whatever. The couch is comfortable. The couch is not comfortable. This it. is not a couch I want for uh, our LA home. Because, yeah, no, it's not comfortable at all. Moving over here, we have the kitchen. I love this. If I could change anything in this kitchen, it would be white. So Natalie always has two or three candles running simultaneously. And they all have different smells, so the smells clash, and it just stinks. It, it smells like anthropology. So this was also one of our first purchases. Yeah. Was, like, this long table that we got at Bloomingdale's. So like, oh oh yeah, yeah, baby. Oh my god, wow. There are my dead plants. I've tried and I can't. Want to see our trash? Bubba, why do you always do I this? I video where I edit That's in, so like, weird. Really nice Usually my juicer is there, but we already packed that. So I like this fridge because you can actually control whether this is going to be a freezer or for meats and stuff. So I put our chicken and our fish in here. There's our little... Robot that cleans. This is reality guys. So this was our guest room But it kind of turned into like a little storage when we moved everything from the studio So we have a lot of stuff here by the way the giveaway winner at the end of the video will be announced from my last vlog There is a mini Tesla. We got like enough referrals codes so that eventually our kids can ride. Yay! All right, Hang on. Let's go upstairs. Let's go. Come stop here. We have converted this, which I actually wanted it to be something else, our DIY little section. Because we moved from the studio, we had to move everything here. 
These are all our DIYs, all our crafts. It makes it really accessible. Right over here, we have the little loft area. It took us a long time to complete this. I really love the way it worked out. And I actually work here and spend a lot of my time. I have all of my amazing books, which I can't take to LA. This would be like my number one thing I would take. Why? I love books. That right over there by Oh Joy. So comfy and I wanted to say, if you are a YouTuber and you don't have a monitor, get one. It is a game changer. And also get yourself one of these chairs because it helps with your back so much. Like I'm just always bouncing on it and it's just really great. This is my beauty and makeup room. Um, pretty much it is what, it, yeah, what it, what it looks. <laughs> this room was inspired by a sunset. It's like one of my favorite times of the day. So we decided to paint this. So Natalie has no taste in like fashion. I actually purchased this off-white bag for her. The only one out of all of these that I feel like she actually wanted for herself. Yes, uh, is that one, which is really pretty. And he's much on his ass. <laughs> on the toy's ass. I bought this, I think, at Urban or Anthropology. It's a cute little chair. It's a really uncomfortable, but it's cute. Our closet, which again, we did not do anything special to. I'm taking this, this, that. We got a lot to do. We have a lot of luggage. Welcome to our master bedroom. This is literally my favorite part of the house. It's so relaxing. It's so amazing. We have the best view ever. It's so bright. The ceiling, the ceiling, the ceilings are tall. I love our bed. I'm gonna miss this bed so much. But we already ordered another one. Shout out to LG. Hook it up. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't until a month ago that we put our TV in our bedroom. Because I had always said, no, 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 I'm not gonna be that girl. I hate, like, I've heard of people that, you know, their husbands will just watch TV and, like, their girl will be trying to sleep. And it's, it's the like, opposite for it's us. No interaction, but I love it. <laughs> um, over here, it's pretty much where I keep the Bible. We do, I keep all my workout stuff. I don't really know how you organize it. <gasps> Look at this little sushi lamp, you guys. It's so cute. I usually keep some books here that I like to read. Got this one by Marie Forleo. Thank you so much, Marie, for sending me this. Everything is figure outable out now, September 10th, I think. Link below if you want to read it. I'm excited. <laughs> hold up, hold up. Uh, also, uh, Natalie showed you another one of these. They sell these at the container store, but they help with organization a lot. Barely ever sell them. It's like barely. Is ever. it IKEA? Yes. That corner is our Dyson grate. It cleanses the room, it filters out the air. It's very, very nice. So welcome to our bathroom. Dennis was the man behind all of this. So as many of you guys know, we do have some vlogs on us building the house. Dennis was the one that picked out this entire bathroom. I was very hesitant because if you know anything about me, I like everything to be white and pristine, but he went more for a darker vibe and I love it. Literally, I always feel we have the rain shower head, which I highly recommend. We have Best perfume ever. It smells amazing. Makeup fridge. Oh, this is the best purchase ever. Look at this one. It has a little handle. I'm gonna have to leave it. Looking for a great deodorant that's natural. This is the one. You don't sweat. Wait, it's wait, amazing. Wait. You have to like rub it like a hundred times in your <laughs> You have to rub it 40 times. That's the only downfall. All I see is, is Natalie every morning. Is that the toilet you poop in? Oprah and Gail. I buy Oprah. Oprah, let's meet. This is our bath. <laughs> you didn't answer my question. <laughs> Nothing really special about this one, and yes, this is the one that I poop in, but I've been taking over your bathroom. All right, so this is our camera room, camera closet. So I actually have to pack all this probably tomorrow. All our tripods up here, all our lenses over there. I have our drone up there. All the lids, caps, batteries. I like the way you keep that organized. Properly organized. A product that never made it. <laughs> Restroom, it's Just wild. Like, Natalie used to edit here and now she switched over to the other side. Have you sat here since we came from the studio? No. You know? So we have one video where Natalie didn't speak and literally all the comments are, we can't hear Natalie. <laughs> Why? Why? So I'm never doing it's that again. I have like a permanent camera that I have here and then we have a monitor. This is always pointing down. This is where I film, yes. Then we have a random head right over there. Whenever Natalie tends to finish filming, she just like, Get up and like, I just want to go eat sorry. and relax. Um, we're going in here. This is the bathroom. Natalie has a lot of ta-ta inspired <laughs> uh, artwork. Oh, natural. Oh, natural. We also, also got that girl over there. I like her butt girl. to be there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, you're so cute. You're so little. Have you met 77? Yeah, he doesn't like her that much. Why do you pick 77? Because it wasn't going to be 6, 6, whatever he had. 69. 69. Hell no. Yeah, this is the reality of life. <laughs> Iron, we got to crunch the ice up. 
for sure. That's how the lights really look like. They're amazing. Yeah, buddy. This is Dennis's room. Bom, bom, bom. Bom, bom, bom. Oh my god. So I obviously like sneakers and I've actually limited myself to only eight pairs to LA. Which ones are your favorite? These for sure. I've only worn these once. Those so these are kind of boring. <laughs> First time that we ever shot hashtag viral. Oh. And I haven't worn them since then. Show <laughs> oh my cost. Uh, Sesame Street. Woo! Yeah, yeah Flyboy. That's boring. Show this. Woo! Woo! And my custom belt PC. <laughs> which is amazing. I just wanted to say that, see, this is why I'm trying to get more comfortable with the idea of like talking to you guys more as people and as friends. <laughs> Anyways, to kind of finalize this video, I just wanted to say a huge thank you to you guys because honestly, like we have been able to acquire all of this in our career and just like our jobs and just all of this because of you guys. And I cannot be more grateful and I know Dennis could not as well. You probably don't know how to express it. <laughs> I'm letting you speak for the both of us. But I genuinely just want to say thank you guys so much for all of you who have been on this journey for a while now or if you just stumbled upon us. Thank you so much. We are so excited for I guess like the next chapter of our lives in a, in a sense. Like we're going to be going to LA and just kind of, it's kind of nerve wracking. Like we both are kind of nervous. The ups, the downs, I don't want to filter out anything. I just want to leave it as is. If Dennis and I arrive at first day in our apartment and we're crying, I'm going to post that because <laughs> that probably will happen. <laughs> but also I think that like it's kind of nice that we're still going to have this house temporarily. We don't really know what's happening. Be able to come here and kind of unwind and you know, not be so like fast paced because we both are, I'm very fast paced. I don't know, you're a little slower. You're a little slower. <laughs> okay. But like LA is just like my energy, like I love it. You know, a lot of people think that when people move to LA, like they change. Hope that that's not the case that you guys see with us. Of course people change and people evolve. And for me, change and improving is always a great thing. So there, there will be a lot of changes coming with ourselves and just like our lives. And you know, when we have kids and whatever else I, happens in our life, well, we're gonna change. I also think maybe, um, People that go to LA by themselves, yeah, like they they're kind of like exploring uh, just new things and and but I feel like since we're, so going, happy going, we're going we're going as an established couple, I feel like it kind I'm of so changes happy. things. Yeah, <laughs> I would cry. <laughs> anyway, imagine if it was just you. Just oh going hell, by yourself. No, I would not be able to move to LA by myself. I wouldn't. We're leaving to LA on Monday, and we have a hurricane coming. Oh yeah, that's so happening. I, so stay tuned. I don't know yeah. how things will work out in regards to that, or if our flight might get canceled. But you'll find that out. That will be a very interesting vlog. The giveaway winner for the last vlog is this person right here. Congratulations! Covering Katie. my face. We love you. Yes, we love you, and we'll see you in the next vlog. Bye. You have a hole in your pants. Oh. Uh, where? <laughs> <laughs> hey! I'll just twerk it.